uh, we expected the harder the brain was working, the, the better people would do. And it turned out to be exactly the opposite. One of the nice things about doing this kind of work is that when you have a hypothesis and it, the data come in and show you exactly the opposite of what you thought would happen, that's kind of an exciting thing. Uh, and we interpreted this inverse correlation between metabolic activity in these specific brain areas and scores on the IQ test. We interpreted that as evidence that it wasn't how hard your brain worked that was related to intelligence. It was how efficiently your brain worked. And that was the origin of the brain efficiency hypothesis, which has now been studied by groups around the world and still is being studied to try to understand what brain efficiency actually means and when it is relevant. 